Welcome to the Super Amazing Project Easter Edition. So how can we make this episode Easter-y, apart from the um, bunny on the TV? Mm, we could wear rabbit ears. I don't- what? But there's none for me. Uh, you can be an Easter bear. What the hell is an Easter bear? Just put it on. Well, this looks tremendously stupid. So what egg did you get, Daniel? Well, obviously. The bunny <laughs> laid that. Oh god. Yeah, I can't imagine this being a very comfortable process for the Easter Bunny, having no. to lay these, um, cardboard cuboids. <laughs> I got a trapezium-shaped caramel egg, but it's more of a air yeah, now. Like throwing a sausage into a hallway. So anyway, let's go to the news. <laughs> <laughs> that was spontaneous. News. In the only Easter-related news that we could actually find, someone made a big hot cross bun thing. That's massive! Whoa, I would eat that twice. I would ride it. <laughs> <laughs> I meant that innocently. A woman has lost a world record 413 million pound lottery ticket. <laughs> uh, the McDonald's worker called Mirlande says she has no idea where it is, but she's sure she has it. Oh yeah, because that's gonna work, isn't it? Oh, I just won the Mega Millions, but I lost it. But can I have the money anyway? That's what I should do. A village mayor in Spain has brought in 65 walls to combat rude behaviour. From slurping soup to breaking wind in public, these things will now be illegal! Yeah. Someone's in the cinema and they're going... At the end of Titanic, and then some guy just runs in. SWAT team bursts through <laughs> the cinema screen, just like battening them in the face. That sounds kind of cool. It's illegal to slurp! In a real life movie reenactment, a pilot has had to make an emergency landing after finding a snake in his cockpit. It actually happened! And Samuel L. Jackson was there. Okay, too. so, I'm, okay, well, it happened in Australia, it makes it slightly more believable, because yeah. that's the sort of crap that happens in Australia. A cat! We've always got a story about a cat. A cat has returned <laughs> cat to crazy. their owner after 16 years of being lost. Um, it was missing in the woods. I reckon it was having a real life animals of farthing wood time with Hunger lots of animals. Hunger Games. <laughs> and finally, a crocodile gets a prime spot in the sun after mistaking a hippo for a rock. It's probably my favourite picture ever, I think. Let me see it. That's amazing. <laughs> it just makes you realise how bloody humongous hippos are. Yeah, it's just they? oblivious to the fact it's got a little death machine on its back. Maybe they're best friends and it's like some kind of comedy film. <laughs> I ship croco po. <laughs> I shouldn't say words. You need to end your life. End of news. <laughs> <laughs> so, before we move on, you may have noticed a number of secret hidden Easter eggs within the news segment. Yes, and now it is up to you to save the universe as inconveniently a giant galactic death bunny is ready to liquidize the universe unless he gets his egg sacrificed. So, you need to tell us how many eggs you saw within the news segment or something terrible will happen. Dun dun dun. Feed me eggs! It's the old school bath scene. Yeah. I'm sliding towards you. This is very oh, uncomfortable. Go away, go oh god, away, god. Go oh god. Go away. Ow. So Megan and Olivia were watching my latest video when this happened. <laughs> what? Oh god! That's horrific! There's a mouth on my what? ear! What happened to your mouth? <laughs> That's oh the god! Worst thing I've ever seen. Amanda saw this creepy moth leaf flying outside her window and it wouldn't leave her alone. That's so weird. Is it a leaf? Is it a moth? Is it a leaf? Is it a moth? Decide, Jesus. What have you created? <laughs> I mean God. Sorry. G God. <laughs> <laughs> Demi sent us this photo of Alex Day possessed by a witch. Isn't that horrific? His face is melting! He's obviously a cyborg underneath. That would explain a lot of things. Rosa sent us this sexy picture of a guy from The Wanted and someone is headless next to him! Oh yeah! Yay! That's like a boring version of that. That's just something that happens with water, you idiot. I could tell you the science, I remember. The light goes through the pool at a different rate to the light going through the water in the air and then everyone's headless. Phil has more than two brain cells. How sexy is he now? Physics. <laughs> Lauren's sister bought a new house with a creepy wall face. Not a creepy wall face. Oh my god. It's like a cherub or something. Ugh. That's so weird. You can see like boobs as well. No, look at the face. Yeah. And then look down. The boobs are where the boobs should be. That's scary. That's a full-on person in the wall. I think you should leave your house or burn it down. It's that wall from Star Wars. Janine and her friend went for a walk and they stumbled across a fine gentleman who was selling 
doll heads. What? How much were they costing? Well, he is obviously your friendly neighbourhood psychopath. <laughs> I wouldn't buy any doll heads of him if I were you. Or can they? And finally, we've had all the laser animals, but Matt has made laser Dan and Phil. There we go. Oh, that's pretty amazing. That's a slightly less disturbing note to end on. Yes, my light's gone out. <laughs> Send your spooky happenings to... So, this week's Twitter question was, what does the Easter Bunny do when he's not delivering eggs? Emski says that he plays Mario Kart with Santa Claus and Jack Skellington. That sounds like the most awesome thing. Pioneer says that he eats carrots while complaining about the country's current economic situation. Jess says that he becomes a Playboy Bunny to pay the rent. Hey, hey. And Nikki says that he has sex with chickens to create more Easter eggs. The horrific truth is revealed. And of course, thanks. So that's it. I hope you ate so much chocolate that you are sick everywhere. All over the like button. Phil? Well, we have to ask somehow. Oh yeah, that's nice and subtle, isn't it? Thumbs up this video to win a million chocolate. We don't have a million chocolate. Well, just do it anyway. Well, I hope you all had a lovely Easter, and yes, see you next week. Well, is it next week? There's no, there's no holiday next week, is there? Christian feast day, probs. probably. That's what she said. What's just happened? <laughs> you wouldn't know, Phil. You haven't been on those websites.